Hello, we're going to see how to create plan views with Visual Arc. So here under the Visual Arc documentation toolbar, we have the plan view command, which creates a 2D representation of any of the levels uh, I have in the model. So first, we select the plan view style, and then we select the level we want to represent. Let's select the ground floor now. And now we have to define the area of the object that will be included in the plan view drawing. So we define it through a rectangle here and now we select an insert point. Here we go. The plan view drawing is created and this is actually a 2D block that has the same attributes as the object it represents. So all the layers, line weights, hatch patterns of section attributes that we can see here are the same as those that the 3D objects have. I can control the area of the plan view just selecting its control points. So I can just define a new area for the control points and the plan view will show only the objects included in this area. So we go backwards, we turn the control points off, just hitting escape, and now we're going to make two copies of this plan view object. One and two. Plan view objects are actually blocks, so that means that they have still some parameters I can change parametrically. So I'm going to tell this uh, copy that is now showing the, the ground floor I would tell it to show the first floor instead. Here we go. And same for this one. I'm going to tell this plan view to show the terrace floor. I have other parameters to change in plan views. For example, I can tell it to do not show the boundary of this plan view. Or I can just uh, change the plan view name, which is actually showing me the level name according to the names I have here, right? But I will just add some text here, for example, floor. Okay, when I click here, the plan view updates according to these changes. Here we go. Also, there is this tolerance factor which determines the level of detail the plan view is generated with. So the higher this value is, the less detailed the plan view will be. And it is also related to the unit's precision of the current document. So as long as I don't explode the plan views, I will be able to change these parameters. And also anything I draw on that model, for example, if I draw a box on here, let's uncheck the snap points for a moment. This drawing should be updated with the changes done. So I'm going to run the update command. And as you can see here, the drawing updated. I have also the option to uh, create plan views from a custom curve. So I can have any kind of curve. Let's watch the model from the plan view. And just create a plan view using this curve. Again, we run the plan view command we select the level we want to display and now rather than inserting a point we will select the from curve option first so now we select this curve and now we can already insert the plan view in the model so it shows exactly this corner 
according to the, the curve we used to as a boundary. There is another parameter for plan views, which is the uh, scale factor. So we can just change it and make this plan view be scaled. 